It's the energy vibration lesson for the third quarters for the Aries, Leo, and Sagittarius. I want to say thank you for being here. Thank you for being back. Thank you for the wonderful positive energy vibrations. I want to say to each and every person, um, this quarter is the last quarter of the year 2019. And I want to say thank you for being here and thank you for the wonderful positive energy vibration. Let's see what is happening for you, Aries. This is a quarter of the devil, the tower. So you Aries, you have to be careful in this quarter. First, you have the energy of the magician, whatever the issue is, whatever the situation is in the month of October. It is as if you are going to be receiving a go ahead for something or you're going to be getting out of something because the universal angels and guides are going to be protecting you and helping you to get out of a situation that you have been in. Okay. So, um, this is an air energy. You are a fire sign. You got to be careful, um, because, um, certain things, justice comes up, justice comes up. So whatever the issue is or the situation, justice. So be, um, be careful that you're on the right side of the law. Whatever is transpired, there is justice that is coming up. There is the balance that is going to be coming to a situation. Whatever the situation that was plaguing your life, a balance is going to be coming to this situation. So you have two air sign. You're a fire sign. You gotta be careful. There's a lot of enemies, but they can't touch you anymore. Okay. Whatever is transpiring, some of you are receiving. Um, the energy of there is the moon. Now the moon is a scorpion or a Virgo, but it doesn't have to be always. It can be a cancer also, but this moon is coming up as your enemies and your enemies can't reach you anymore. So they're trying a lot of stuff, but the universe is going to be coming in because justice is coming in to cut the shit down. Whatever that was playing, whatever that was happening, justice is coming in to cut the shit down. So what is your quarter is looking like? Your quarter is really clearing up some issues and situation. Whatever is transpiring, your quarter is like clearing up some issues and situation that was transpiring in your life. Whatever the energy of the magician and justice comes in, what that is saying is that your enemies, whatever that is transpiring, whatever is happening, justice is standing in and they are going to be cutting down and get rid of your enemies once and for all. Let's see what is coming out. Some of you are dealing with the King of Cups. Whoever this King of Cups is, is a Pisces, Cancer, or a Scorpion. Whoever this person is and whatever this person was doing, justice is coming down on this person because they realize what this person has done. And justice is coming in and coming down on this person because they realize that this King of Cup has not done, um, have not been playing the game and the rules how it is supposed to play. And justice is coming in and taking down this person and this situation. Justice is coming in and taking down this person and this situation. We have the Knight of Pentacles. This is someone between the age of 18 and 45. These two people, justice is coming in for them and justice is going to take them down. Whatever they have done, justice is coming in for them and justice is going to be taking them down because these two people have done some injustice and they have gotten some of you in some huge problem and uh, it's as if the universal angels are coming in and entering and, and they are going to be clearing you of this negative things so here we have the six of ones the six of ones is in reverse whatever the issue is justice is taking down these two people so for these two people there is not a positive ending for them because they are about to see jail time for some of them they're about to see jail time i'm seeing some of you really giving up these people and said hey this man has asked me to do something i'm seeing here that um some of you who had an issue or who had a situation with this man you are speaking up against this man and you're saying this is the man that came in and told me to do whatever i have done okay this is the person that got me involved in this issue i know nothing about the person i know nothing about the situation this man is a pisces cancer or a scorpion and some of you are going to be talking and giving up this man for whatever they have done because you realize that you have found yourself deep in um, something that you weren't supposed to be in. Some of you who are dealing with an Aquarius and 
um, a Pisces cancer or a scorpion justice is coming down on them whatever they have done and whatever they have transpired justice is coming down on them and I'm seeing some of you really standing up against them and speaking up and justice is coming in now for these two people these two people this um, Pisces cancer or scorpion man is older um, the other person is younger whatever is happening whatever is transpiring these two men are in for a surprise because there is no good um message for them because um justice is going to be seeing what they have done there is no good message for them because justice is going to be seeing what they have done some of you are dealing with a young man between age of 18 and 45 that person is coming up as a fiant you got to be careful and you got to be aware of what is transpiring around you, you got to be careful and you got to be aware of whatever is transpiring ar ar around you um, because um, Pluto is coming to release um, and make a transition Pluto is the renewal the inner resources and the motivation the cycle Pluto is coming to release you from these two men these men is um really decept um really um, um they're working together but they're working together and jail time they're definitely going to be seeing jail time because I see that you guys see that you have been in such a situation that these two men have brought you in and they are going to be seeing jail time now whoever this older man is is a Pisces cancer or a scorpion um, I'm seeing you speaking up about this man and speaking up and saying hey this is the man that came to me and asked me to do whatever and that is why your enemies you're dealing with um, you're dealing with um, your enemies and your enemies is um, a younger Taurus Virgo or a Capricorn person with a man or woman okay a Capricorn comes up here and I'm seeing um, people speaking up and I see um, this is a boss that you have been dealing with some of you have a boss that is a Pisces cancer or a scorpion and you're speaking up against this boss or you're telling what has transpired so the Capricorn is going to be coming up a, um, the Capricorn with, a, with with Aquarius could be coming up in your life to help you to stand up to equality and injustice against this man Neptune is coming in and in your intuition you are going to be finding out that balance is going to be coming in however way the situation that is transpiring and however way this is happening balance is definitely going to be coming in your life because Neptune is coming in Neptune is bringing balance to situation behind the scenes um, without you even knowing what is transpiring in your life Taurus is here and some of you could be dealing with a Taurus this Taurus is an enemy this Taurus has to do with this Knight of Pentacles so whoever the Taurus is this Taurus is a Virgo um, is at um, is between the age of 18 and 45 whoever the Taurus is this is a person that you're dealing with and you are going to be um, um, ending this situation um, and be aware that this Taurus is your enemy so this Taurus um, this person is uh, your enemy so for some of you this is um, your enemy that is coming up as a Knight of Pentacles in the reverse some of you you have other enemies and it helped me to mark because um, you are um, stable and you're making your life and you're moving forward in your life and this person wants to work against you King of Cups is here and this is uh, someone who is coming up um, and and this person is really have two faces whoever this person is they have two faces whoever this person is they definitely have two faces you have to be aware of this um, this is an older man um, and but this person has two faces and this person is working with the Knight of Pentacles and this person has two faces Jupiter is here because you're going to be having some luck over this Knight of Pentacles whoever this Knight of Pentacles is is going to be caused a call caught, um, caught and uh, you are going to be paid out in full whatever the issue is or whatever that is happening okay so whoever this person is some of you are going to be meeting a Taurus for a Pisces cancer or a scorpion this person is coming as in as someone in a love relationship someone who cares about you but this person is not supposed to be trusted because they're working with your enemy a Taurus Virgo or Capricorn do not trust this person no matter what they're coming in with don't trust this person some of you are going to be falling in love with a Taurus Virgo or with a Capricorn 
and some of you a Capricorn is going to be opening the doors of opportunities for you okay so be aware of that let's see what is coming up with the energy of the Capricorn and the magician the Capricorn and the magician you have a transition that is coming in so there is definitely a, a, a transition that is coming in for the Capricorn and the magician whoever and whatever the situation is there's definitely a transition that is coming in for the Capricorn and the magician there is some um, jealousy lies and jealousy and justice is going to come in to bring down this deceptiveness that has been working justice is going to be coming down to bring true the de de deceptiveness people are going to be talking about this and seeing the truth to what has been going on you're going to be finding out the people who um has been working against you who is this king of cups he's coming up as a romantic partner so some of you this person could be coming in your life but this person could be having to deal with other situation issues and situations so be aware of this there is an opportunity that is coming in for you there is an opening there's an offer of love that is going to be coming to you from a Pisces cancer or a scorpion man this is an older man so it could be your father for some of you this man is your father because it's as if this whoever this person is is going to be helping you out this is an opportunity at work whatever the issue is whatever the situation is I am seeing the universe is opening up because of something that a young person between the age of 18 and 45 that is a Taurus Virgo or Capricorn has done the universe is going is opening up a lot of new opportunities for you um, especially when it comes on to work because whoever this person is has done you some injustice and because of this it's as if um, the universe is going to be opening up and luck is going to be coming in for you guys and it's because the downfall of a young person a Taurus Virgo or a Capricorn um, you are going to be winning this but it's a young person it's not a older person this is a karmatic situation that you're dealing with whatever the issue is and whatever the situation is this is a karmatic situation that you're dealing with and there is a transition that is coming in for some of you that have health issues this is going to be um, release this is going to be clear up I'm seeing a balance is coming in with this health issue that you have been having but definitely I'm seeing that love is coming in and it's coming through a Pisces cancer or a scorpion for some of you uh, a younger person that is a Taurus Virgo or a Capricorn is definitely going to be having a downfall and with this downfall what is happening and what is transpiring that is going to give you luck so with this downfall it is going to definitely give you luck because of what this person has done um, their downfall is where your luck is going to be coming in there is a lot of talking and a lot of situation your enemies are trying to get to you but they can't get to you you have to be careful for a Taurus because whoever the Taurus is is that um, they have been trying to ruin your life in whatever way and there is a lot of talking because whoever your enemies are they're trying to reach to you but they can't reach to you because the universe has set a block between you and them but somehow this person came through and they are going to be finding out who this person is and what they have been up to and they're going to be bringing an end to it now whoever have a legal situation um justice is going to be coming in and with justice coming in what is going to be transpiring is that definitely justice is coming in and this is going to be happening in the month of November because in the month of October the tower is there in the general reading go and check out the general reading and after the tower comes down whatever needs to leave your life is going to be leaving your life and you're going to have a good a go ahead for a new start okay in the month of November Neptune is here month of November is the energy your energy vibration so whatever negative things that was happening to you the energy of justice is coming in some of you are working negative energy is going to be t returning on you for instance in the month of November if you try to do or pay someone else to do negative things against another person this is going to repel on you and you're going to be feeling it and it's going to be coming on hard really 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 hard okay whoever is dealing with a young Taurus Virgo or Capricorn be aware because uh, there is a transition that is coming in so for some of you you are going through a really um, hardship whatever the situation is you are going through hardship 
and Pluto is coming in to remove this hardship and remove this issue and situation it is definitely a karmatic situation whoever is having health problems it's going to be good let's see what is coming in we have the um, copiona and this is good this is positive because this is financial abundance this is abundance in all different forms it's going to be coming into you because of some downfall from someone who has done you some injustice okay so you know life is full of surprises number 11 is here for you guys number 11 is here definitely um um, there is a lot that is going on the magician justice twice number 11 so there is going to be a portal that is opening up so wishes are fulfilled in this period because you're working away the negative energies abundancy is going to be coming in and blessings is going to be coming in for you guys so that is good the copionia um, the coin Ucopia is a gift from the universe that is going to be coming to you and this gift can be financial riches but it could be fulfillment in love relationships so that is good you can receive the corniconia cup and this is going to be very positive and very good ready for a great fast of abundance the value is being prepared for you and spirit is applauding all of you for your efforts so this is really 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 positive here we go again we have strengthen bonds okay strengthen bonds so this is good a lot of you um, this is the ace of uh, um, Pentacles this is strengthening bonds and whatever is transpiring and what is happening I'm seeing that your financial stability is going to be getting good because there is a new start to your financial stability okay so this is the ace of Pentacles because this is from the John Holland this is the ace of Pentacles so strengthening bonds is the start of a new um, situation for your financial abundance this is very very good for you Aries so this is going to be a good third quarter you have a lot to deal with but yet still you are going to be coming out feeling really good because money and financial stability whatever that was transpiring was that was against your causing or making it's gonna be paying you out in a very good possible way okay so um, ladies and gentlemen please use the link here or um, at the other side or down here to get to your extended reading I love you guys and I'm wishing you a wonderful positive um, three uh, months October November and December I will speak to you in October namaste <music>